I, I auditioned for that show, The Blacklist, 12 times before I booked that role. I'll tell, you, I'll tell you about the first audition I did for them. It was for the role of Arab terrorist. That was the name of the character. <laughs> you know, one of those episodes that's really shattering stereotypes, bringing people together. <laughs> My big line was, I want to help, dot, 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 but without approval, dot, dot, dot. I had more dots than words. <laughs> so the role was quick, intense, and ethnic. The three things I'm known for on screen. <laughs> and in the bedroom. <laughs> I don't really know what ethnic in the bedroom means, but uh, I think it means something like this. <laughs> something with a lot of R's. <laughs> So um, the, the line was actually in Arabic, and I don't speak Arabic. So I had a friend of mine teach me how to say it. And then I was practicing it over and over uh, on the way to the audition on the subway at rush hour. The car cleared out. <laughs> I didn't get the part, but now I use that line whenever I need a seat. <laughs> I had an audition for the show Homeland for the role of Middle Eastern bodyguard number two. I got to the audition. I did my line. You're on the wrong floor, miss. <laughs> the casting director said to me, you're overdoing it. Do it again and do less. How? You want me to not move my lips? <laughs> so then she says, okay, here we go. We're going to do it again. And I'm thinking, how am I going to do less? So this is what I did. <laughs> Didn't get the part. <laughs> But that same show called me back to audition for the role of Guy in Gym. And my, my agent warned me, she said, they're gonna want you to take your shirt off for this audition. So I did what any actor would do. Started doing a lot of push-ups. Hired a trainer. Cut out carbs. Turns out you can't get ripped in 48 hours. <laughs> Agent calls me again with an audition for the show Girls for the role of Adim, a Pakistani cabbie. I was so excited. Pakistani cabbie, not an ethnic thug. <laughs> ethnic, but not a thug, so that's progress. <laughs> I read the script. Adim runs over an old lady. <laughs> ethnic thug. <laughs> I got to the audition, I saw the other actors who were waiting to go in to read for the part, and they really looked like Pakistani cabbies. And then I went over to the sign-in sheet to put my name down, and I saw the names of the other actors. There was a Muhammad, a Mahmoud, a Muhtada, a Muhammad Muhammad, a double Muhammad. <laughs> a guy actually named Adim, the name of the character. <laughs> and then me. Ethan Hershenfeld. <laughs> and I got the part. <laughs> I was shocked. But then I thought it over and I realized those other guys looking the way they looked with those names, they were overdoing it. <laughs> <laughs>